Oh, this is my first time uh, actually uh, coming to a premiere on uh, on the studio a lot. Very, very fun. Very fun indeed, yeah. These studios, if they could talk, they'd have a lot of stories to tell. Well, it's been around a very long time, you know. It was written in the 1880s and it's lasted a long time purely because of the story and the messages that it, it tells and they've, they've never really got old. They, they're as relatable now as they were when they were written. And I think kids relate to Pinocchio in so many ways, and he goes through so much in such a short period of time in the in the story. But you know, the, they're all sort of rites of passage and life experiences that, uh, through his eyes, allows children to understand and learn. It's beautiful. It's 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 very fun. It's an, it takes you along. It's very sweeping. It's it's got it all. It's got it all. This this little wooden boy goes through an awful lot, um, but it's a, it's a story full of hope and joy and happiness and terror and fear and doubt and mischief and fun. And I'm a little bit of all of that. Sing any song, never mind if it's old or new. But this one was great because it was brand new. It was written for the coachman, and it's brilliant. I loved every second of it. Yeah, it was very fun. Very fun.